The palace of the Enoge of Ulubu was agog as indigenous of various communities converged to witness the inauguration of Mr. Geoffrey Asokorami as the liaison officer on administrative community on Ishekri matters to the Enoge of Ulubu Dukedom, His Royal Highness Jensen Akezwa. Addressing the people, the Enoge of Ulubu community, His Royal Highness, when Jensen Akezwa said the appointment of Mr. Asokorami became necessary following the prevailing peace in the community and urged the people to report to Mr. Asokorami on any challenge to avoid disharmony and called on the Benin's and the Shekiri to remain as one. It's our collective duty and collective responsibility to ensure that over 400 years of history, of shared history, is not destroyed due to certain individual selfish interests. Having said that, Ulubu is part and parcel of Benin Kingdom and it's my duty as the traditional ruler here to take everybody along. I have never marginalized anybody and I don't have any intentions to marginalize anybody. And that is why I have made fit to establish this office. And to Kobe Charles, first of all, congrats on your position. My advice to you is to work tirelessly to bring the bonds that tie us, to make the bonds that tie the business and the security stronger. In his acceptance speech, Mr. Geoffrey Asokromi pledged his affliction loyalty to Obaiwai II, the Oba of Benin, and the Enoge of Olubo Dukedom, His Royal Highness, Owen Jensen Akezwa, and promised to unite all. It's an occasion that will further unify and cement the bond between the Shekiris and the Benis of Ologodukdom. There have been crises over time which has actually led to the wanton killings of our brothers. They are unnecessary if we live by the spirit of brotherliness that we had. The Shekiris and the Benins of Ologbo has the relationship of over 500 years. Some leaders comment on the new dawn in Ulubu community. There were various cultural displays to spice up the events. Yeah. Wellington Hakodeja reporting.